All right, welcome to Nashville. Yesterday I thought I could have been dead today. So I used the ball I had on yesterday. Today I got to thinking I may not live to see another day. So I spent all my money on today. Tomorrow if I'm still here, hold oh, sorry, fellow I'll be. Or I'll have nothing left on me. Take it away, Noel. Somehow I'm still alive And God keeps throwing days my way Despite all I live in for today For today! <laughs> Somehow I stay alive Through all this crazy shit I've seen And show sure it's nice to see you all again mm. Take it out! So we are live at Centennial Park, and this is the only exact replica. Exactly. So this is the best Parthenon, in my opinion. Other than that, that one in Greece is very old now. Oh, All right. We got a couple friends with us here. We're gonna introduce them to you pretty soon, but we're gonna. Yeah, we ran into a couple friends here in Nashville that yeah. we will we'll do some songs with. All right, let's do. I feel like it's a little crooked. Like what do you need way? here? What do you Just need? Just a little bit that way. No, the other way. The other way. That way, yeah. Does that better. work for you? Yeah. But better. now the Parthenon is crooked. I don't care about the Parthenon, it's crooked. It's meant to be crooked. How dare you say you don't care about the Parthenon? I do care. I don't care. That's crooked. That's, it's intentional. We just learned that from the tour guide. Okay? We did just learn a lot from it. Uh, uh, what do you call it? Freelance tour guide. There you go. That's the word I was looking for. We meet all kinds of people here in Nashville. He did know a lot, though. I'll share it with you. Drove all this way Been gone now three days Trying to save some money this year But the ones that I love Are so far away What am I doing here? Oh, what am I doing here? Oh, what am I doing here when the ones that I love are so far away? What am I doing here? Hey, Frere. Hey, Frere. I never thought I needed anyone else but me. I thought I could get by just fine. Now I need my baby's love Like a drunk needs his wine And I'm going home To my baby tonight
so far away What am I doing here When the one that I love is so far What we learned about the Parthenon so far is that it was brought over for the World's Fair um, not long after the 1890s World Fair in Chicago. And they, uh, they wanted to, they, they, at the time, Nashville was called Athens of the West. So they brought a little bit of Athens over here. They brought a huge bit of Athens. And now, <laughs> they, they, we learned two things. We learned. What did we learn? The, 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 the things are angled a certain way. This looks crooked on purpose. The pillars, if you continued the pillars, all the pillars up a mile high, they would meet in a pyramid. Yeah. It's a very, very gradual pyramid. So it kind of is like very slightly like this. But if you kept it going for a mile, it would, it would go up into a pyramid. And yeah. then later we're going to go inside and see Athena. There's a gigantic 43 st foot statue of Athena inside there. And part of that move, part of the part of the new uh, Percy Jackson movie was filmed right here. And then we're gonna gonna well, like show you our, we're gonna do some friends with our some friends with uh, some friends with our songs. We're gonna have some friends with our songs. Yeah. We got time for one little story here. It goes like this: On a warm summer's evening, on a train bound from nowhere. Met up with a gambler, we were both too tired to speak. We took turns of staring out the window in the darkness. Boredom overtook us, he began to speak. You got no way to hold him, no way to fold him, no way to walk away. Now when he finished speaking, he pushed back from the table, crushed out a cigarette and faded off to sleep. And somewhere in the darkness, the gambler he broke even. In his final words, I found an ace that I could keep. You got no way to hold him, and hold him, no way to fold him. <laughs> All right. Welcome. Welcome to our friends, our friends Lexi Weege and JJ Slater. JJ. Right. So we ran into these two folks in Nashville. Yeah. So we're going to go, we're going to go to their gig. Where are you guys playing tonight? Tennessee Brew Works. Yeah. Tennessee Brew Works. We're going to go down and see the gig and I'll, I'll live stream from there as much as I can too. Ah, <laughs> uh, well. Oh, well, welcome. Yeah. Thank you. It's great. We haven't yeah. seen each other in months, but we meet each other in Nashville, a thousand miles from home. <laughs> great. I love it. Huh? Great place. Hey, Do you just want to go to Big River? Let's go to Big sure, River. Sure, yeah. When I come in with the willow, I didn't call, I call. I showed the cars and it go away through the blue sky. But the tears are driving them away. I'm going to hurt you, girl. And I'm going to sit down here until I die. Well, I'm going to sit down here until I die. Yeah, 
That's beautiful, that's beautiful. Hey, hey, hey. I'm not hey, here. Hey. <laughs> oh. It's a beautiful place. Right? Look at this place, this paradise. Yeah. For, for, for the place I come from. Where? I'm the original, I come from, from Greece, but I live, I live in New York. Oh, wow. Oh, all right, right on. Okay. You guys are beautiful. This is the heart of the United States. You guys, you preserve the qualities, the qualities of, of the history of the United States. We are wrote a big article about the, this, because uh, I'm a writer and poet, about this temple of here. No, I'm going to amend that and put my experience, whatever the experience. I come over here for one day, we're going to stay here for four days. You guys, you're beautiful. God bless you. Wow. Thank you. Yeah, I travel you know. a lot yeah. in my life. And mm. this day and night, like, I feel like in a, in a different nation from New York over here. Oh, oh, it's a big country. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I feel like I'm, I'm not in the United States. I'm in a different nation right. yeah. compared to New York. Oh, yeah. 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 Thank you. People, people, everybody. Right? <laughs> this is like a gun to my heart. Oh, man. Picture I born in Greece. I, I born in Greece. I, I mean, uh, this is one of the best uh, landmark uh, building. Because you guys, you could choose another building, another, you could St. Peter's, or another, but you, you decide to choose this building to crown your, your city. Yeah. This, is the, this is the holy crown of the entire city. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Hell, yeah. What's on your list? What's on your list that you'd like to do? We could do some Stand By Me, that's easy and nice. And all the darling stand by me, oh, stand by me, oh, stand by me, stand by me. If it's hard that we look upon. It's a crazy, crazy 
say about it here. They didn't permit food, drinks, gum, or pets in the original part of the night either. <laughs> it's true. One thing, one thing that hasn't changed. Here we go. Here's to tell you about the sculptor. Alan, I don't know. I think a bird took a dump on his middle name there. There were a couple different architects in different years. So in 1897, oh. Colonel W.C. Smith was the architect. And I think he probably died or he just got bored. And then in 1921, Russell Hart was the architect. Then he probably died or got bored. And then in 1987, Gersham and Smith and parents, partners, took over the project. Maybe it was just getting fucked up and they had to like, you know, 
fix it. And isn't it wild that his last name was Sculptor? What are the chances? What are the chances? All right. Well, can we let's go in? Let's do yeah, it. Let's go in. Let's go in, fam. All right. Come on in. Tickets in the museum store. So. Oh. Yeah, the old rubber pencil trick. <laughs> so they charge you 10 bucks to go in and see Athena. She's a pretty lady. Last time I paid 10 bucks to see a woman and I was very disappointed. Oh, it comes with a giant pencil sharpener. Oh, look at that. That's how you sharpen the giant pencil. Oh, the giant pencil sharpener. So I'm going to write the great American novel with this pencil. Yeah. Well, without the sharpener, the thing would be pointless. Did you all turn to stone? <laughs> Thank you. We're good to go. That was the old one. So there's lots of artifacts and things in here. I, I the fella told me there was even uh they even put some things from the Percy Jackson movie that they used recently. All right, let's get right up there and see that. All right, here's what we've <laughs> this is what we've all been waiting for. All right, you ready for this? Here we go. What? Behold. I remember the movie Clash of the Titans. When she came alive. Say goodbye. So with the scene in the background, we're gonna we're gonna say our goodbyes Jake, here. Goodbye to people who stuck in the entire time. Bye! Alright. Thanks for watching. Bye. From the Parthenon. <laughs>